Right, okay, yes, 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 guys. Uh, You're going live. Today we're down at Anderton and Rowlands Fun Fair. Look at the state of this. Hey, thumbs up for the channel. Hey, Fun Fair audits. Right, you're on YouTube. Right, we're down at Anderson and Rollins Fun Fair today. We're down in uh, Torquay. <laughs> License to grill, let's start off at the burger bar. There's another one, thumbs up for the channel. Right, okay, let's have a look at this. Look at the state of this thing. Look at that. What on earth? I'm going to have to have a suck of that. Oh, there's a cap on it. I can't do that. All right, okay, let's go around. Let's start off with these onions then. Oh, let's start off with the onions. We've we, we, we got to start off with the onions, Woo! haven't we? Right, there's raw and there's cooked. There you go. I know, but which one do you prefer? Oh, what's all my mind? Yeah. I like cooked onions. You like the cooked ones? Yeah, I like them. Uh, do, like, do you like soy sauce on them? Because I quite like them with a bit of dark soy on them. Let's see, you, you want to get technical? <laughs> right, look at these folks. Look at these. Yeah, we've got some nice chilies and tuck on there. And we've got the curry sauce. You know what it's like, we've got the curry sauce. Fair play. Fair play. Right, let's get on and... Uh, <laughs> let's get on and uh, have a look at this... Uh, what we got down here today then, down in Torquay. <laughs> oh, I can have a swig of this now, can I? Thank you very much. Mm. Crikey, you've got to have a good suck on that. <laughs> right, come on, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Look the duck, we're straight in with the ugly duck. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a good vlog, isn't it? <laughs> right. Start off with something quite unusual. This is the only travelling com de fur in the UK. There's one other com de fur, and that's in a static park in Wales. Jump in. Um, that's owned by Ben Devay. Um, 19.99. Spanish company, just like the uh, Safcos. Right, last time I had to go on one of these things, CJ gave me the darts, and I was having to chuck them left-handed. It's a wonder I never hit him. <laughs> I'll see you on Friday, CJ. He's down in Exeter. <laughs> the old time swings, the good old chair of planes. A&R. More rock the ducks. We got a couple of ghost trains down here, folks. That one's owned by James Kefford. That was manufactured by uh, Gilbert Chadwick in 1971. Starflyer. Yeah, I've been on the damn thing. You know I don't like it, but I only do it for you lot. So you better subscribe for that one. Oh. We got lucky as well because we just missed a thunderstorm. Though it's starting to black up over there a bit. Starflyer, Charles James Farrell. AK Rides, Slovakia. 2014.
Got plenty of hot food down here, folks, for you. There's another one that does curry and chips. Hey, I'm spoiled down here, folks. Fun house. Not sure who owns that one. Oh, I know who that is. That's Philip Rawlins. Yeah, Philip Rawlins. That's quite a nice touch, isn't it, folks? Somewhere to sit and eat your hot food. Yeah, you got tables, tablecloth. Ah. Someone's made a bit of an effort, and they even if they are plastic. So what? Well, it just brightens it up a bit, doesn't it? Bouncy slides. You like me, dear? Got a few inflatables down here. This one's owned by Aaron Brett. It's a Sonic case. UK make. Uh, 2000 that was built. Quite an impressive looking pay box. Your tokens now for the next ride on the Star Flyer. Now we're on grass again here, folks. After that hot weather, I mean, look at it, it's like sand. So don't do anything silly like having a fag on here because that'll just go up like crazy. We've had a drop of rain this morning, but. I only, mean, it just hasn't touched it, this ground is absolutely, it's like concrete, so yeah, be sensible. Might be an idea to wear some sensible grips on your feet, mine, because it is on a, a bit of a slight slope, so with it being as short as this, it, you know, it might get a bit slippy. We are forecasting a few showers this week, I'm down here on the Monday. Quick look at the juvies while, uh, while there's no kids on it. Over the back you've got Terminator, Miami. Quite a lot of rides down here actually, folks. That one's owned by Alan Jenkins. Fair mat. 1993. Now I've been told that some of these rides are packing up tonight and uh, going down to Paynton. I know there is a uh, fair on the Sanderton and Roland stone in Paynton currently, but it, nobody really seems to know for sure whether it actually is some of it's going or not. So I don't know. I mean, a lot of the operators I spoke to said, well, we're not going, we're staying here. So, I don't know, there seems to be a, a lot of confusion about what's going on here. Dodgems. I think there's only the one set here. If it's what I believe it to be, it's the F1 Dodgems owned by Ben Devey. Made by a Czech Republic company. 
uh, called Bojugs. Uh, and that would have been in 2017. say uh, F1 on it, it says Atlanta Dodgums. Ah, I'll tell you what it is. If it's Atlanta Dodgums like it says on there, it's actually owned by Alan Jenkins. Yeah, it's the Alan Jenkins one. That's 2006, made by Harry Steer Engineering. They were based up in Derbyshire. We're going to have to get through this walkthrough a bit quick, folks, because uh, that is a, a black cloud approaching. Now, here's an old favourite. I've seen this a few times this year. Bath, Clevedon. Sure, there's somewhere else, and now it's down here in Torquay. Freddy's Revenge, Sean Rogers. It looked like it was running full pout as well earlier. That was made by the Belgian company Sabima. 1991. Let's let you have a, a focus on that for a moment while I have a while I have a drink. It is so hot, folks. I just need a drink a moment. Hold on. Right, Superstar, this was a credit for the channel. Film this on an off-ride. Keeley Wall. Another Superstar built by Northern Amusements, 2001. I've been very rude folks and I have not paid any attention to this particular store today for some reason. Crepes. I quite like me pancakes as well. Nutella, Oreo, Lotus. How you doing mate? Alright. Yep, we love that. Got the fat on for the donuts as well. Right, keep on bringing it round. Tagada! As you know, I don't film these on ride. Just a bit nervous about. Uh, Losing the camera, they can be a bit vicious. And this one was quick as well, I was watching it. So, no, there's no fear of me filming on that. Michelle Jenkins owns this one. 
Not a company that I know in the way of uh, build. It was built by an Italian company called uh, Soriani and Moser. I don't know what year it was. It was sometime in the 1980s. Tagala. Ah, oh, now there's those Formula One dodgems. So uh, that was what I was thinking it was earlier on. So yeah, that one's the one that owns, owned by Ben Deve, Bojux, Czech Republic, 2017. One juice. More slides. Right, what I haven't shown you folks is the other ghost train. Now, uh, this one's owned by uh, Lawrence Nipper Appleton. Self built ghost train. All right, buddy. You're going on YouTube. Hello. Fun fair audits. <laughs> right, go strain. 1993, and the cars were built by. Um... Oh, God. Can't remember now. Modern products, that was it. Modern products. All seems quiet, looks like he's gone for his tea. All right, well, while he's gone for his tea, let's get up there and I can give you a, a front shot and you can see what, it, see what it's like from a pay box view. He was hiding in there when I went on it earlier on at all. Kept on jumping out on us. Oh, looks like more tissue. Right, let's take it down. More inflatables. Got one of your tilting balloons that you can spin. Ground's a bit rough here, so I'm sorry, I'm shaking the camera a bit. Go Gator! Charles Farrell. Built by Joey Rose, 2012. There's a bit of information there for you. Parents can ride. Mind you, you'd have to be a small parent, I think, to get it, get on one of these things. Let's have a look. 
Oh yeah, I suppose she'd uh, get an old dose in there all right. Yeah, you manage that all right. Fun for all the family. Oh, don't forget to like and subscribe, folks. I had two hours sleep last night. I had to get up at four o'clock in the morning to come and do this fair. So yeah, we're on a long jaunt. Keep your eyes open on the channel, folks, because we're doing Exeter on Friday. Two toilets. Now there's a good booster. KMG over the falls. Did this once at Elkiston. Probably the nicest um, booster that I've ever been on. I haven't been on it today. I thought it was a bit steep. I've got to try and make my money last this week, being down, as soon as I'm down here. I've got to live on uh, takeaways and stuff for a week, it's going to start mounting up. Yeah, it's a really nice one, that, folks. I remember last time I went on it, it just... It was quite a nice, smooth ride. It didn't feel too forceful. Yes, the cars flip upside down when you're at the top, but it just didn't feel that, you know... It didn't feel like it was whipping you about. Very nice booster. Free coats. Free coat afterburner, George DeBay Jr. KMG 2007. I've been on this one, so you've got a, an on ride and an off ride POV to come on the channel for this one. Fun fair audits. Shout out to the operators. Toasted waffles. Do you know, I've never had a waffle in my life. I might waffle on, <laughs> but I've never, I've never eaten a waffle. Right, now this is a gem. Maxwell, 1978. And that is rapid. Unfortunately, I filmed a on-ride POV of this earlier on and the camera cut out. There's still about four minutes worth of footage that I've got of it. But yeah, it was a bit of a blow that the, uh, the camera cut out on me because that was really going well. So George DeVay Jr. Maxwell, 1978. <laughs> He's taking them. Two waltzers in an interior Rolex. Hey. Section one, number one waltzer. Interior Rolex. Section two. He's taking. He's number one. He's taking them. Go on, spit it, spit it out. 
We got the best one. You got the, the you got the best one. You cannot beat an original Maxwell machine. You cannot beat it. Bloody right, you can't beat an original Maxwell machine. Right, okay, let's get off here before he turns the bloody thing on. <laughs> Alright, either way, I'll teach you how to walk it if you want. Yeah, fair play. <laughs> it's gonna teach me how to walk it. <laughs> yeah, it's a lovely waltz of that. Really good and well, right, no, number five's the fast car if you wanna go on it. Right, and I think we're just about there, folks. I think we're done for Torquay. Keep your eye on the channel for Exeter. Yeah, we're back round to the Tagada. We won't finish there, though. We will show you just one more thing. H-A-P-P-Y. PP! Right, stick with us, folks. Let's try and cross this main road, it's a bit bloody busy. I gotta try and find out where the bus stop is. Where's that going? Oh, that's the number 12, that's not mine. I need a number 22. Yeah, it's pretty good fair this one. There's also an Anderson and Rollins fair on for the whole of August in Paynton, which is just down the road. There's a Rollins fair up in Exeter. I'm not sure how long that one's on for. There we go, folks. I'll leave you here from Anderson and Rowland's Fair. Like and subscribe, thank you. <laughs> so there we go, folks. What a beautiful way to end the vlog. People in the water. Nice spot. Plenty of places to sit. Don't know if you can make it out there, but you've got the big wheel over there as well, which is nothing to do with this fair. I think that's a permanent feature. And that's down by Torquay Harbour. Right, so from Torquay, thanks for joining us. We'll see you on the uh, next vlog very soon. Bye for now.